In this module, we will talk about again the foam control system. But as I have already told you in our previous module that uh, we have to be very careful in case of uh, this foam control system and the selecting of the anti-foaming agent. So, there are different factors which affect on the anti-foam requirement. First one is the nature of the medium. Medium or a media rich in the proteins will tend to foam more readily than the simple media. If there is a media having carbohydrates having a less proteins then there is a less chance of foam formation. So, the nature of the medium is very critical factor in producing the foam. So, the product so when their fermentation process will on number us various kind of the product is are formed. So, as concern the nature of the product then that can affect on the foam production as an example that secreted proteins nucleic acids when they release either the cell death either by the hydrolysis of some detergent like properties. So, that is why that help that facilitate the foam production. In third case aeration and the stirring speed of the impellers also affect on the foam formation. So, the fourth problem is that the use of the mechanical foam controllers. The foam control device such as mechanical and ultrasonic foam breakers help to reduce the anti foam requirement. So, that can also be when there is a highly aerobic fermenters sometimes we can change the, the fermenter type. Sometimes the stirred fermenters replaced by the air lift fermenters or any other type of the fermenters. So, there are different strategies that can be utilized that can be used for decreasing the risk of uh, foam formation. So, as concerned the fifth effect on the head space volume sometimes when we utilize uh, the maximum capacity of the fermenter that is mostly I have told you already that 75 percent of the total capacity of the fermenter can be utilized and the 25 percent space is required for the head space that is basically for the oxygen transfer and gaseous transfer and the foam production space. So, if there is a large head space then there is a greater tendency for the foam to collapse under its own weight because when there is a increase in the then sometimes what happen then there will be a automatically self killing of the foam bubbles. So, if we keep the 50 percent head space volume then that is basically this kind of the situation we can uh, see, but in case of 75 percent we have uh, the problem. So, as concerned the fifth, but as concerned the sixth the condenser temperature. So, in laboratory scale reactor the cold condenser the temperature can help to control the foam. So, the density of the foam increase when it moves from the warm head space volume to the cold conde uh, condenser region. So, this can cause the foam to collapse. So, by this strategy by using the condenser temperature we can have the less risk of foam problem. So, on other hand if there is a chemical anti foamers then we can use some mechanical foam cutters as I have already uh, told you in a one point. In this slide you can see that foam cutters mechanical foam cutters, but there is one problem by using the mechanical cutters foam cutters because in a small scale there are different gadgets and the probes has to be fitted with the fermenter vessels, but in such case that can only be possible in a large scale or industrial scale fermenter when all such kind of the probes are attached to the surface or the periphery of the fermenters. So, that can only be so there are different shapes and uh, you can see here that uh, this one this is a having a sharp edge blades. So, different shapes. So, in this slide you can say another type of foam cutter and then here you can see an other foam cutter which is mostly utilized in a industrial scale fermenters. 
so there are different uh, um, engineerical uh, shapes which can be utilized but there is only one uh, problem that uh, there should be a free space where we are using otherwise there is uh, uh, if there is any probes inserting from the top to the uh, fermentation medium then we cannot use these uh, mechanical foam cutters attached to the surface of the working volume. 